Well, warm or cold, Chiefs Kingdom will still show up to cheer on the Chiefs. And as KSHB 41's Rachel Henderson shows us, some fans have a unique bet on the line. You've heard of the friendly bets between local politicians and other cities, but here at Brookdale, a senior living facility, they've got their own take on a friendly wager for the home of the Chiefs. That's right. Their bet is a video challenge with their sister facility in San Francisco. The losing team owes the winning one a video, a congratulatory one. But honestly, a humble surrender works too. I would like to hear them say what a good job their opponents did. We knew it all along. We knew you were better than we are. Some might call these fans cocky, but they can't help it. Back then, it was really fun um, because we were winning. I started working part-time there in 66 and also tried out and became a cheerleader for them. And Maggie's not the only one with stories to tell. Jack Stedman, who was a big man at the Chiefs, offered me a full-time job. So I chose the college marriage KU route. Years later, she figured out love and football could coexist. Tay Tay and Trav have really added a lot of interest to this year. Leave Taylor and come with me. He acts like a little puppy dog around her. Come Super Bowl Sunday, they'll fill this room and watch him fetch a win. They hope. Just like the Chiefs, these seniors plan to put up a good fight. Because after all, we're going to fight for the right to party. Rachel Henderson, KSHB 41 News.